Hello, everyone. And there is a sea beast across from me. No, sorry about that, ma'am. That is Mama Firaxis. The mother of uh, Mama Shark. We're not gonna attack. We're not gonna talk about what had happened in the last episode. Cause Mama doesn't need to know that. Let's get the frick out of here quick. But well, we are here to get this uh, star map. All right. Item received. Journal entry update. Journey enter. Journey journal entry added. And all right. Now we gotta make our way back up. But we are going to go talk to the two. Two that we talked to beforehand. I want to know though. Can I talk to you? Even with all my Jedi knowledge, I can't talk to a sea beast. As you can tell from the last episode, we had completed much of Mama Paraxis's lower area. But now we are going to go to, we are in the finale of Manan. And um, next episode will most likely be, oh lord, that one might be a lot more, that one might be a little more difficult. I, I really try too hard, actually. Like, I try to split up what, where I might need to split them at. No, we're, 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 we're gonna try to go with what we can. Alright, so now, th this is the immediate way back to our, uh, friends. Let me see something. They're 5,000 away, and that robot's not going to give me about 5,000. Oh, I think I've been poisoned. Mm -hmm. Sure. I mean, I did technically get damaged from the Frax and Sharks. But not this time. <laughs> so... This is closed for a reason, but since... We were taking care of the reason in Tatooine after we executed the Ghetto Haradon. You know, because we're just complete BAs. And now, I mean, not just because we're wearing a dark, set, dark Jedi Master yes. armor. Do we have any other. Uh, you know what? No, I technically do want to. There we go. I think I've already done this, but ha ha ha. Yep. But we are going to go through here and we're just gonna leave, right? Right. Yeah, yeah we're, we're just gonna leave right away. The submersible can only be used to ac ascend to Auto City. Use submersible. I'll see you all in a bit. And welcome back to Manon. What all is right, it? now let's just get the hell out of here. Oh wait, what the? The function that function cannot be available at this. It's not available at this time. Or it's unavailable. This function is unavailable. What the? Oh, we do gotta talk to this guy. Right, right. We do gotta tell him what happened. You've returned. 
I was beginning to fear that you too might have been lost. Did you find out what had happened down there at the facility? Your construction woke something Something up. was down there? Living in the rift by the Colto? A giant Faraxian shark that drove all the Sokath insane. It's horrible. The entire operation wasted by a disaster we could never in a thousand years have foreseen. What really? has happened to the facility itself? Were there any survivors? I got my arrow. Few survive. A few scientists have survived. Oh, I forgot to talk to them. Ah, whatever. The, what, the man hated what you did, and the girl actually liked what you did. Well, that's good to know. Good to know indeed. But what has happened to the facility? Was it damaged? The harvesting machine ha was destroyed. No, that is terrible. That will set our work back years. It may even cost us the war. While I am glad that you were able to solve our problems, the cost may have ended up being much too high. But you have done your job and helped us in our time of need. And for that, I thank you. Oh, and did you end up finding your star map? Yes, sir. As you can see, by helping us, you helped yourself. Perhaps yeah. we can work together again in the future. Journal entry added... I, uh, credits received 500. Experience points received 900. Items received one or some, and items lost. That means I cannot go back down ever again. No, what I meant was this. Alright, show feedback. Acquired cardio power system, credits, lost bay key, and chemical canister. Also, the summit, the Sonic of Mares. But as you can tell, we apparently did not lose. We did not lose one thing. Come on. Where are you? There we are. Enviro suit. This is a variant of the standard model, model Enviro suit used to protect its an occupant from hostile environmental conditions. In this case, it was specifically modified to withstand tremendous undersea pressures. Alright, I wanted to talk to you about also. Greetings once again. I trust you have been discreet concerning the events at Rackard Rift. Should the Selkath obtain proof of what occurred down there, the consequences for the Republic would be severe. For both our sakes, I hope you are smart enough to keep silent on this matter. Truth be told, I'm uncomfortable even with us being seen together. The rumors are already plentiful enough among the Selkath about the Republic's role in this. I'll be going now. Then I shall wish you good day. On behalf of the Republic, I hope you enjoy your time here on the Nile. Alright. Alright. Okay, yes. I guess we can leave now, sure. then, right? Alright, yeah, let, let's get the hell out of here. This is boring. I want to get to the next planet. Wait a second. Really? What the frick is now gonna happen? Not like I did something that fucked with the planet. Did I? Well, we'll see in a minute. Let's get the hell back to this shit. What the hell? Yes, I'm gonna act like it. I know what's going on, alright? Oh, no! I'm getting arrested! Oh. Third time now. Stop, human! We have detected a number of underwater detonations coming from the vicinity of Raptor Rift. You have been known to have questioned about this and our spy monitors in the Republic Embassy report you leaving in submersible that's descended to Raptor Rift. You will come with us immediately to answer our question. Answer for your action, or we will force to we will be forced to take you by force. Very well, I will come peacefully. Very well. This one's gonna be different, watch. No lawyers. No lawyers, I guarantee it. No lawyers. But, if they can do that, the whole system could. Silence. This is not for outsiders to hear. Well, human, you find yourself in the most difficult situation. The Hractor Rift is the most... is the most precious resource on and on. Anything that threatens it, or the culture it produces, threatens our entire species. We will not tolerate threats to our neutrality, our existence, and our way of life. As much as we admire the, your Republic and your order in particular, I believe you have a hard time. You will have a hard time explaining your role in this incident, incident adequately.
we will we have determined that you are responsible for the detonations that have occurred near Hector Rift. We demand to know what occurred down there. By the council, you will tell us now. If the Republic has broken its neutrality with us, the repercussions shall have well, shall be very grave indeed. What have you done to the rift? When did I get into Skyrim? The explosions were at the research station. Both our governments have set up down there. I'm not going to lie to them. I haven't lied to them. Well, I haven't lied about myself. Other things, that's not. That's a. Me. I've been doing to work for the gut for not the government for the galaxy Research station what are you talking about don't try to lie to us human We know of this what it will be discussed later this cannot be silent the council will the council will hear nothing of this, and you will keep your silence, or be ejected from this court. But we cannot... Silence! God damn it. What happened to the res- what happened at the research station? What caused the explosions? The machinery had woken a giant Phyraxian shark. A giant Phyraxian? Could it be impossible? It is only a legend. But he said he killed it, didn't he? You killed the shark human? I destroyed the machinery to save it. The Prognator. It must have happened. Be quiet. That is merely a myth. And not for outsiders to hear! But if it was a life bringer, the ancestor of our species, think of what this could mean. That's what I'm not going to go through quickly. It was. It, if it always layered there, then perhaps a cult of enough upworlders are not to hear of such things. This is a mean guy. But he said he saved it. He destroyed the harvesters to save it. Indeed, this cast your actions into new in a new light, human. This, I believe, will require more thought, both in you, on your actions and on what we must do in response. This court will be adjourned and while we deliberate. I did that. We have reviewed your actions in the situation, human. We thank you for the destruction of the machinery and saving the giant Phyraxian shark, which we believe is the source to our culture, or at least its guardian. We will no longer, we will not continue any longer. While we cannot show our gratitude over, overtly, we know, know that we have earned our respect. This trial is now over. And we have done the biggest, greatest deed. Saved a mighty piece of this world's history. But we are going back to Yemen Hawk now. Guess what? We're leaving this planet forever. There's nothing left on this planet except most likely Pazak and, of course, Swoop Racing. I gotta remember this, actually. Uh, let me see. This has a one. That's a one. Wait, who's the one? Let me see. Yes. Oh, it actually decreased the thing I needed. Racial group? Oh, can destroy it's okay. 524 418 418 
721, but I don't want the first number to increase. I want the back, yeah, I don't want the back number to increase. Assemble. I'm keeping that. There's no way I'm getting rid of that. That's staying there. But... Oh, I have to... Oh. I will, uh, look. 721. Actually... Hmm. We could go do something. Yeah, you know what? See, there, there are going to be some stronger crystals anyway that will increase this, which is what I'm more of trying to increase, plus this, too. The bolt deflection will be perfect. This one's the only one that might have an attack modifier. Eh, no. Sorry, Opalot. For now, I'm going to keep this. Oh, right, there's still one more. I can't, though. I can't give it to the, her. Wait, wait, wait. Let me see. Okay, no. Oh, uh, did I, no, I want to put that with, uh, that and make it, there we go. Oh, wait, I haven't even seen if anything else near that. I'm... No, okay, no, yeah, no. There's only a few actual of these I will have. And that's usually the ones you find throughout the quests. Or throughout the time you're playing. Ooh, maybe I could put that... Ooh, no, yeah, no, I... Uh... If, oh, I, I can show you. you there, there's a way to... To at least switch your character stuff while not well on the ship. Like I gave Basil an Arcanian shield. I keep forgetting and a melee shield right now. He's got all. He, I'm not. There's nothing else I need to put on him. Oh maybe. Uh, what's this do? Oh why do you have that? Sure. Let's give him that. Heavy combat? No, you get Darth Bandon's armor. Now she is immune to mind affecting. But then I could give her this. Uh, I'm gonna keep this, because to get a hard on, I might. It's more of a situational item. I'm not gonna lie, it's situational to me. Uh, yep, no, Wookiees can't have anything in these two slots, as you can tell. Ooh, he's level three on this. That means I can give him immune. Ooh, yeah, no, there is a way to give him immune to poison. But I can give him more health. Poison immunity. Health. Ooh, that does buff it up. But the poison, uh, poison's also situational. Health is perfect. Um. Oh, hell. There we go. Now he's immune to that. Alright. Everyone has... Oh, I forgot to do the one thing I wasn't meaning to do. I'm sorry. You're being upgraded to a new lightsaber. Here you go. Ah! <laughs> you heard that, right? I'm not... I can't amplify it, but she just wielded her, her lightsaber. But... Okay, that, that's the end of what I'm going to do for that point. I technically was supposed to do that off camera, but we just got back on the ship. Got something on your mind? Do you want to talk about the war now? Not particularly. No time like the present. I suppose you're going to nag me until I cough it up, aren't you? Yep. Nothing is private anymore, it looks like. No. Nope. Uh, there's no escaping it, I guess. Yep. So be it. My wife's name was Nayama. She was the Yukatis enforcer who shot me out of the sky, if you remember. What does your wife have to do with this? My wife had plenty to do with the war. Upon meeting her, I knew right away that she was strong in the Force. 
That's oh. why she was able to shoot me down. Nayama was a marvel of a woman. Fiery, determined, smart. She dragged me to the capital and foiled three of my attempts to escape prison. Really? Oh, that body. <laughs> the war? Well, yes, that. <laughs> Needless to say, I eventually won her over. That was after I kidnapped her upon being broken out of the Yukata's prison, mind you. But, uh, that's another story entirely. At any rate, I wanted to train her in the Jedi way. The Council refused my request, naturally. I was still a Padawan at the time. I was an experienced Padawan, surely, but not yet ready to be a full Jedi, and certainly not ready to train another, especially not one so old as my wife. You disobeyed the Council. I did. I wasn't the first, and I won't be the last. The problem with self-righteous folk is they think they're more right than everyone else. I believed in her and trained her in secret. I ignored her willful nature. I loved her too much to see fault in her. And she loved me too. I know she did. At the time, our love was a shared bliss. Better than anything I had known before or since. So what happened? Exar Kun is what happened. Niyama was inspired by Exar's promises of a new golden age. She wanted to join him. She came to me, pleading with me to throw aside what she called the decrepit trappings of the Jedi. To join her in Exar's war. So, she fa had fallen to the dark side. I hadn't thought so. Not right then. I was too proud to believe that of her. I had trained her myself. I loved her. I pleaded with her yeah. to reconsider to think about all that she was throwing away. To think about what she would become. She would have none of it. Finally, in frustration, she attacked me. She drew her lightsaber and attempted to strike me down. It was a scene being repeated everywhere throughout the galaxy. Yeah. Pupil against master. In my case, it was a long and terrible battle, but I defeated her. So you killed her? No, no. I had her at my mercy, disarmed and defenseless. She looked up at me and she knew. She knew I couldn't do it. I don't think I could have either. But I should have. Sometimes I convince myself otherwise, but it's no use. She had fallen to the dark side when she raised her saber against me, and I let her go. To my shame, she went on to kill many Jedi during the war, until she herself was slain in the final battle. I grieved for her death, inevitable as it was, even as the Jedi Council put me on trial for my actions once the war was over. They put you on trial. For I had trained Nayama against their wishes. I had failed to kill her when I had the chance. And she went on to kill others. Not to mention that I had remained a Padawan throughout the war. A formality, perhaps, but with a trial, it had to be decided if I was worthy to become a Jedi at all. It was a travesty, of course. I told you that even the Jedi were capable of great injustices, didn't I? So you did. So you think you didn't? Of course I deserve to be punished. They found me innocent anyway. Even though I deserved every punishment and more, they let me go. Wow. Mitigating circumstances, they said. I deserved compassion, they said. They said I had learned wisdom the hard way. For all I had done during the war, they wished to raise me to full Jedi status at long last. That, that was when the Jedi left me. That was when they failed me. Oh, no, maybe you don't at that. They may have been able to forgive me. I could never forgive myself. And you still believe love is worth the rest? I, yes, I do, I suppose. Does that surprise you? Uh, no. It is all so long ago, lost in the winds, I suppose. Nobody cares what an old man believes anymore, do they? Let's continue on with the task at hand. I would prefer to think of the present today. Wow. You successfully convinced Joe Lee to talk about the Sith War, how his wife turned to the dark side, and how he ultimately abandoned the Order for not holding him as responsible for her actions as he held himself. You might be able to ask him more about his past a little later, once you have gained more experience. Damn. 
go see if uh let's see if Mission might have anything else to say. Hey there, what can I do for you? I've made my peace with Griff and what he means to me. If he ever shows up again, I'll deal with him. But I'm not gonna dwell on my brother anymore. It's time to move forward. So, is there anything else you need? Well, you know anything about the plan, right? Manon's the source for all the Colto in the galaxy. That's why there's fish faced Cellcat can stay neutral in this whole Sith Republic war. But I don't know much else about this place. Sorry I can't be more help, you know? Is there anything else I can do for you? Okay. Well. Hey everyone. This is where we're going to leave this episode off at. So if you like this video, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Now we're able to deflect. Our, our lightsabers themselves can deflect. Five points. A bolt deflection. Not entirely sure how that actually really works out. Since we also have the feats for up to three. Uh -huh, uh -huh. The droid has the mouse. I mean, I can see. I uh, but that's the funny thing. Chewbacca has twelve. Naturally, Wookiees have apparently twelve defense. Ah, uh, oh, I can up. Oh, uh, I could. I can level up anybody I want. But I can't actually level them up. Alright, everybody. If you like the video, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Next episode, we are going to... Korriban. Or it might just jump to Yavin. I don't know. Maybe, unless something big is gonna happen. Foreshadowing enough, right? Right? Enough foreshadowing. But, yeah, we might be going to the last planet to get the final star map. And we'll finally, finally go find where the Star Forge is. Though I won't lie, most likely you guys won't be able to see what it actually looks like. Sadly enough, because. Stupid cutscenes. Check out my channel, see what other videos there are, to see what you want to play. If there's nothing else you want to play, uh, nothing else you want to watch, write down in the comments what other video games you want me to play. Be a boss at, or just rage quit. At. And hit that notification bell to be notified the next time I throw up another video. And everyone, I'll see you all in the next video, and we're going to complete this game. Bye-bye!